Hey guys, my name is Cineag and welcome back to Mint Tycoon. Well, last episode, guys, we were checking out all this sweet high skier and we started to rub everybody's little vaults and we managed to steal Robux in the last episode. And it gave us over 100,000 from stealing, I think it was like 500 Robux from that one dude, which is absolutely crazy, right? Damn, it's crazy. So today we're back here and I've got 300,000 in the bank and I want to finally build the second printing press. It's been a long time since we built the first one, got it all set up, uh, you know, enabled us to start printing ticks. Then we bought the Robux section of it. Now we can make some sweet Robux from it. So I think we're pretty much ready now to start printing our very own ticks and Robux at the exact same time. Now just look at the coin situation first and we need some more silver coins and gold coins. Let's turn this one onto bronze. This will be getting it all ready for when we start selling some stuff. This one can be silver, and then finally this one can be gold. Bam! We've got them all going down good now, guys. JJ, everybody. Right, and so while they're now producing silver and gold to keep our um, kind of currencies all topped up to a thousand, let's jump straight into it then and then start buying everything we need to build this second printing press. Now, I've got 313,000 in the bank, so we're pretty interested now to see how much it actually costs us to build the second one. I have a feeling the price is going to be identical, but I can't remember how much we completely spent on building it. So, it's 15,000 from the get-go, just to get the printing press all set up ready to start producing ticks. But we got to buy all the upgraders for it. Now, what's the cheapest one? So, we got autom automatic controls is probably the cheapest one alongside... Uh, creating that water marker as well. Now, we're actually creating some ticks too right now, which is quite cool because we still got, you know, a little bit of a storage issue right there. Yeah, boy. I feel so good to be making ticks right now. Like it turns, almost turns into lava, which is pretty scary, isn't it? Right, let's get the uh, the water marker on it. So we can, you know, put in celiac in words on your boy's ticks. That's how it's going down, guys. It's legit how it's going down. So let's get the paper infuser as well then. So, you know, we, uh, we're infusing the paper with all the good stuff. So it's uh, the best quality around. <laughs> also as well, once I get all these upgrades to it, it's going to put like a huge effect on, on um, when I go to sell it with the quality bonuses. So we've got that down then. We might as well get the uh, micro printer too. And build the RFID tagger. Not sure what that is. Legit not sure what that is. But what it's enabled me to do that, you, you know what? It actually wasn't that much stuff we needed to buy to get the second printing press all set up. It wasn't a lot at all. But what I'm going to do then is we'll come back to that in just a moment. But we're pretty much maxed out then. We've bought everything there is to buy here right now. Let's open up the, uh, the back doors as well. Right, I'm going to have a little quick explore around your boy's base. Because I think now, guys... I think I've legit bought everything there is to buy uh, for our mint, which is one is really cool, but at the same time it's really sad because we know that like there's nothing else for us to do in the game. So it's like, is this the end of the series now? I don't know, guys. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section down below. But there's nothing to buy out the front either. Let me just double check. Oh man, I can't wait till like an update comes to this game. We've been playing it for so long. There's been no updates. Uh, the, la the last update, funnily enough, was just before I started playing it. Uh, nothing else appears. So we've literally bought everything there is to buy. Holy moly! But anyway, there's still a lot of things I want to check out anyway. Uh, and things i got to do in this game as well. So I don't think it's just the end just yet. But we pretty much got that uh, second printing press now all set up. I'm going to go sell everything we got now so we can see the actual two printing presses together combined creating ticks and robux so i think then we should get there let's open up the front gate we'll take a nice should we, should we take the bike where's our bike there we go we got the bike last episode we'll take a nice little bike ride all the way to the market where we're gonna sell a bunch of stuff now and get it all up and running there's all these new buildings and stuff like that that we uh coming soon stuff which i can't wait for Whoa, we're in so where's the uh the industrial exchange over here and we want to sell a bunch of ticks and Robux stuff. 
So this one here, 90,000, sells quite a few of it. Yeah, yeah, but I can fill it. I can fill that order big styly. And uh, we'll do any other orders I can take as well. We're falling a bit short on some of the stuff here. I can't do all of them, which is kind of weird, isn't it? But hey-ho. Right, let's jump back on your bike. Where's my bike? There we go. Lego. Excuse me, dude. Coming through. Right. The chat ending because I walked away. Is he going to follow me? I don't know. But we're driving back now. Ready to close the front gate. Oh, we've made loads of robots. I need to sell more Robux. Hold on. Let me get back over there. So I wanted to see the making them together in sync. But we got loads of Robux to sell anyway. So hold on. We're back. We're back, boys. Right. Back at the industrial then. So what are we slacking on? Uh, what's got the lowest bronze? That we need to sell. 850. No, 660. Okay, we're not too far off it. We could get this one. But we just got to wait for him to create more bronze coins. So let's go back home then. So who's making the bronze coinage then? You making the bronze coinage? Right, let's switch you over to bronze as well. Get get double bronze on the go. Switch you to bronze as well. Right, make me the bronze coinage, please. Make me the bronze coinage. Right, well, they're making that then. We're going to head back to the vault. And your boy's pink motorbike. Excuse me! Woohoo! We nearly ran you over, dude! I like how it's got like, blue smoke. Looks kind of nice, doesn't it? Right, we should have everything we need now. Where's the industrial exchange over here? Let's get off the bike. Yep, yeah, we can now sell it. We'll go for this one, because it's got the uh, the most... It's not the one I was after anyway, but it's got the most anyway. But let's now... Let's go back to your, your boy's vault. And uh, let's close the front gate, hoping nobody enters. Right, this one's now producing Robux. Right, this one over here, we're we'll getting to start producing some ticks. So, what you what you, what you turn it into? We got we got Robux set. We got ticks on the way as well. We got both presses set up. This is like legit right now, isn't it? This is so cool that we got both of them set up, making us all that sweet cash money moolah. Get out of here! You're getting wrecked, guys. Everyone's getting wrecked in this server right now because nobody's making as much money as I'm making right now. Which is crazy! Right, we've got... Uh, let's switch over to silver then. We need more silver coins being created. We'll switch this over to gold as well. And let's get back over to the marketplace then. So we've come a long way since we were, we were you know, creating that, that from the micro exchange as the simple bronze coins. We're now at the industrial exchange and we're making so much cash money moolah. It's crazy how much cash money moolah we are making. So yeah, we can fill that order. Look at that. Hundred, look, we get a hundred and sixteen um, percentage quality bonus, which is crazy. It's legit crazy to think how much of a bonus we're now getting. It's beautiful, guys. <coughs> it's legit beautiful, and we've got both presses all set up too. So here come the robux now, and the ticks now being created. It brings a tear to your boy's eye. It's amazing. <laughs> right, okay. So why don't we then, while that's now maxing out and we're trying to fill all of our orders right now, who's big on the server now? Who's got a pretty beefy base? Right, he's got three presses over there, which is not the level that I'm at. He's got, okay, it looks like it's that dude there then who has, he's, he's, basically who's going to have the best vault. So open up the front gate, get on your boys, motorcycle. We're going to go steal from his vault. Right, he's the best dude on the server. Okay, what color is this? He's the yellow dude. Best of all here, now here, gone. That's his name, weirdly enough. He's only got 4,000 set up there, but he, he, he's at the point where he can actually create Robux and Ticks quite easily. So, with that said, we're going to hop off the bike here, go up to his teleporter. How much of this has he actually done? We're going to jump... And we got the jetpack on the go right now. So how far is he? He hasn't actually bought the vault very far. He's only got it up to silver and actually... Yeah, bronze and silver. That's all he's got to. Weak, mate. Right, you're getting hacked, boy. Four second hacking time on the silver right now. Mate, you just got hacked in four seconds. My hacking skills are legit right now. I'm about to steal 500 of his silver. 
four seconds on the hacking on the server. That's that's kind of, that's that's legit crazy. Because when I bought all this like last episode and we kind of found out about it, it didn't really change the effect on hacking on like some of the stuff further down. It was like, still 45 seconds. But now when you come to hack the new stuff, which takes four seconds, you can now notice the difference. Like I could legit attempt to hack this four seconds. It will open the door and then the door will close again, even before I've probably collected all of this. But we'll see how it goes anyway. We'll see how it all goes. But damn, boys, we're on our way to making a million as well. Which if, That in itself is crazy. That in itself is legit crazy. Right, come on. Look at that, I told you. It'll come back down before we've got, well, filled our bag up with the full 500. Right, let's hack that then. We've got the full 500 as well. So your boy is getting out of here right now. We're skedaddling, boys. Uh, we're going to get the jetpack on the go as well. Then we've refueled, restocked. We're all good to go. Ooh. Easy. Hacking people now is just so easy. Right, I gotta go make sure I sell this to the right dude. Doesn't even know that I hacked him. That dude will never know that I hacked him. <laughs> I wonder why what this kind of speed kind of like is like is gonna be then to hack like bronze coins. It's gotta be like two like a two second hack, right? It's gotta be. I mean I am literally gonna get next to nothing for this now. I'm literally gonna get pennies. So I gotta make sure I go to the right dude. So we do know that Drake is the guy that does the bronze coins. So we gotta find the, the dude that does the silver coins. The silver coinage, boy. Right, put the gun away, Sanyak. You're not rubbing. Right, this is Drake there. So I think this is the dude that does the silver and the gold. I think it is. I'm like 99% sure. Right, your boy Rainer. Right, come on, let's speak to him. Um... What, what do you have it? What are you talking about? There we go. Stolen silver coins, mate. I got them. I got them, boy. I got them, Rainer. I got the goods. Where is it? Yeah, it's all here. Right, we legit like, made like 3,000 off all that. So, stealing silver coins is legit not worth it. Not worth it at all. Now, this dude here has got a basic starter um, mint set up here. So, we know full fact he's literally going to have nothing in his vault. I'd be very surprised if he has anything, because he's still got buttons on the actual press itself. So, I'd be very surprised. It's like he's just joined the server and started playing. It's kind of, ooh, that dude, ooh, that dude could have some pretty good stuff in his vault. But I just want to see what the, uh, the hacking ability is on this. Yeah, he's got legit nothing. Right, pull out the hacks then. So I want to see then uh, what the speed is on, on like an unupgraded bronze vault. It's still four. Right, well, hack I'm not going to steal anything anyway. Because I feel bad for stealing. But that dude over there, he's at the same stage as where I am right now. Is that, That's the silver dude. The, the bees mint. That's uh, Berza. So that's the silver dude there. So he's at the same stage I am. With how that you can, you can tell because of how the office is set up, how you get up to it. So he should have like a pretty... Pretty fairly decent min uh, vault setup. So we're gonna go over there now. Hello, hey, visit. Has he disabled the vault, by the way? No, I don't think he has. So we can get in there quite easy. Right, what's my jetpack saying? Anyway, I gotta refuel the jetpack. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. He's. Oh no, he hasn't actually got that far, to be honest. So if I come along here and then jetpack it over, he's also only fully maxed up to. To silver coins, which is which is interesting. Very interesting indeed. Hasn't even started. I mean, he's at the same vault level as I am, and he hasn't started to even attempt to get any gold coins yet. What is he doing? Damn fool! What is he doing? I'm gonna steal some more silver coins. These are the last silver uh, coins that I'm stealing. So, guys. I've been thinking about this. So, if you made it to this point in the video, and I start to see the comments now, I know that you fully made it towards the end. I'm thinking, right, last, or the next episode possibly could be the last one, because there's nothing else for me to actually do in the game, uh, and one, there's, you know, not many things left to buy. Uh, there's a few more items I want to buy in the game, like from the computer, like the vehicles and the travel stuff and the weapons. I want to test all that stuff out anyway. And I want to try and get, like, maybe one or two million in-game cash as well. 
But I'm thinking next episode might be the last one for Mint Tycoon. But don't be sad. I'm thinking after we've done the last episode, should I create or delete either one delete or my can you can I reset my data? Is that a thing? Uh, yeah, I can reset the game. So I'm thinking, should I reset the game and completely clear all my data? And uh, we do a live stream. We'll do like a speed run live stream. And we see if in that live stream we can complete the game again. Let me know what you guys think about that. Right, I've got 500 coins now. Um, completely stolen from your boy in his silver mine. We're going to pull the jet back out now then. Because we need it to refuel so I can actually jump over this little section now. It's going to be interesting. So, yeah, guys, let me know about that in the comment section down below. So, are we good to go yet? I don't know. We'll, we'll try now. Easy, mate. Easy. We're refueling again. Will, will your boy make it? Will I make it over? Here I go. Here I go. Boom! Made it easy. Right, we're get, your boy's got to get all the way back to Reina now. All the way back to Reina. Oh, come on, Mint, man. It's so beautiful. And, uh, but then again, you never know, because if there's an update to come out in between the next episode or the time I do a live stream, there's another episode to record, so many things are going to happen. I think everybody should, like, tweet the developer or message him or something like that, saying, Update the game, your boy said he wants more content! <laughs> right, here we go. So we got to find Raina now. Which one is he? Right, he's not that one, he's not that one. So we go around the corner now. Here he is. Here he is. Boom, dude. I got the stuff. Yeah. It's all here. Another. Do you know what? That wasn't even. I think it's like 2,500 that we get. But anyway, we're back home. We are pretty much all done. We've got our two presses now all set up. So, guys, if you enjoyed this episode and you enjoyed the series all the way to this point, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you're new around here, make sure you subscribe. And more importantly, Make sure you smash that like button. But until next time, guys, I'll see you all soon. So, good.